This tutorial will demonstrate how to use ERP scale with the SAP Packing Station transaction who passed. The Packing Station transaction is used for weighing cartons linked to deliveries before they are dispatched. There are three prerequisites you need to satisfy before starting this tutorial. Number one, download ERP scale from our website and install it on your PC. Configure a Packing Station profile in SAP and connect the scale to your PC. In this case, we'll be using a Metler Toledo PS60. There are three steps needed to complete this tutorial. Step one, create an RSC destination in SAP using transaction SM59. Step two, add the scale to the Packing Station profile in SAP. And finally, import the Packing Station configuration into ERP scale and add the scale to the definition. So step one, we will now create an RSC destination using transaction SM59. The RSC destination is created in SAP using transaction SM59. We will create a new RSC destination and give it a title. So ERP scale waste station one and the connection type is T external program using TCP IP and just a short description. We need to specify the technical settings. In this case, it's a registered server program and the program ID that will be registered from ERP scale will again be ERP scale way station one. In addition, we need to specify the gateway host. In this case, I'm using an IP address, but you may be using a host name and the gateway service. In this case, it's SAP Gateway 61, but it might be different for your setup. You'll need to contact your basis team for that. So that's all completed. We can just hit the save button and it's saved. Step two, we now add the scale definition to the packing station profile using the transaction who passed underscore C, which is a configuration transaction. In order to add the scale definitions to the packing station profile, we need to be in the IMG. You'll find the settings under Logistics General, Handling Unit Management, Basics, Set Profile for Packing Station. Or you can use the transaction who passed underscore C. So here's the packing station that I want to add the scale functionality to. So we'll go into the detail. One thing that's very important if you are using the transaction who passed is that it can automatically recognize the correct packing station profile to use based on the host name of the PC that the operator is using. And this setting is case sensitive. So if we scroll down, we've got the settings here to connect the scale. So we'll tick the box that we want to connect the scale and select the RFC destination. So the RFC destination is ERP scale waste station one. And we enter the scale name. In this case, it's a Metla scale. And we save the settings, creating a transport. And that's all that's necessary in this step. We have now added the scale settings to this packing station profile. The final step is to import the packing station configuration into ERP scale. ERP scale's import function firstly verifies the SAP configuration, including the correct setup of the RFC destination, and then imports the settings into ERP scale. This ensures a problem free integration. We start by opening up the ERP scale configuration utility and select our subscale server, which is WayStation 1. Immediately, ERP scale asks us if we want to import our configuration from SAP. So we'll say yes. And the settings we want to import are for the WhoPass transaction or the ECC packing station. ERP scale does support other imports, but we'll look at those in another tutorial. We now have to select our SAP system to log into. The options here come from your SAP logon.ini. So we'll enter the username. password and client and click connect. 
At this stage ERP scale is reading the packing station profiles from SAP and it immediately selects our packing station profile using the match on the host name. We can click on the button here and ERP scale will read the various configuration elements and verify that they are correct. As we've got green ticks everywhere, everything is correct and we can now start the import. So we'll import a new RFC destination and a new device. As we have changed the RFC destinations, we need to update the server. So we'll say yes, update the SAP scale server now. And because we have changed RFCs, these settings can take up to two minutes to take effect. So we'll just make sure we'll wait that before we do our testing. The next thing we have to do is take our device, and the Metla device has been created, and add the communication settings. So in this case, it's going to be a USB HID POS device. So we select the communication method. We can select our device from the list, and that's all we have to do on the device settings. The other thing we need to do for our testing is just add a license. And remember, you can get a cost-free trial license from our website. So I'm just going to put in a license number here and the activation password and click get activation key. Okay, and now we see the activation key has been updated. So we click save and see up here that the RFC destination has been created to match the packing station profile. So all the setup is now complete. So we'll jump back into SAP to test the packing station. So the transaction is the who passed or packing station. So we'll open up the transaction. Again, because of the match on the host name, SAP immediately knows the packing station we are using. Let's enter the delivery number and up pop the delivery details. So here we can select a handling unit Currently the weight is showing as 1.52 kilograms. If we click weight, the weight will come in from the Metla, which currently is showing 5.84 kilograms. And there we see the weight has been updated. ERP scale supports various functions of SAP. These include the packing station transaction, who passed in SAP ECC, various activities executed using an SCM or EWM work center, ERP scale also directly supports SAP ODA for use with PI sheets and X steps, including data access subscriptions. Through its support of QMIDI, ERP scale allows weighing and analytical equipment to be integrated with SAP QM, including the transaction QE51N. Further, ERP scale has a built in HTTP server for use with MII XML connector. And remember, all these integration functions are fully SAP certified. ERP scale supports many different types of equipment and communication interfaces. Devices can be connected directly to the PC using a serial or RS-232 connection. Also, ERP scale supports Ethernet connection to devices including serial Ethernet adapters without the need for virtual COM ports. With many scale manufacturers now supporting USB HID POS, ERP scale offers plug and play installation. ERP scale works with many types of industrial equipment. The typical usage is with way scales and way bridges. However, our clients are also using ERP scale to interface other analytical equipment with SAP. And remember, ERP scale is independent of the device manufacturer, giving you a wide choice of equipment and supplier. You can visit our website at www.pocketprograms for further information about ERP scale and more tutorials. Thank you for your time.